Hello you guys, this is Jocelyn, my husband Will. Welcome to our new YouTube channel, The Black Man in the Village. We are here in Manila four, t four days ago. This is our fourth day's quarantine. It's not fun at all. All we do is eat and sleep. Well, she eat and sleep. Uh, like she said, we're on quarantine. We've been on quarantine for four days. Uh, we have a 10 day mandatory quarantine. After that, it's on, y'all. After that, we can go to the village. The venture has started. We're going to take you guys along with us on that ride. So once quarantine over, we go to the village. You guys can see the village, see the people in the village, um, see how they're living. And from that point, me and my wife is going to assess and see, you know, where we can help and where the most help is needed. Um, we didn't just come to the Philippines just to come and live here. We're on a mission. Um, I'm on a mission, you know. Right. Um, I want to put a smile on people's faces, and that's what we're going to do. Just like my wife on Beautiful Smile. I'm trying to talk, but all I see is that beautiful smile, y'all. <laughs> Same smile I saw 15 years ago. But to be truthful, y'all, when I first met her, she was mean to me. Yeah, she was mean to me. Yeah, you were. No, uh, me and a friend was painting a house and uh, I needed some more paint so we went to the store to get some paint and she was the cashier it was one person in line so we got in line behind that person but we didn't stand directly behind the person we stand a little bit to the left of the person so while she was ringing up the, the person at the at the counter and we were standing there, about seven or eight more people came and stand right behind the man. But we were a little bit to the left. So when she finished that customer, she looked up and she looked at us and said, the line is right there. You, you guys need to go get in line. And I looked at my friend. I was like, what? We were here before these people. So I, I told her, I said, I ain't going back to the end of the line. We was here before them. And we didn't move. So she had the service. But she was mad, y'all. I could tell she was mad. But when I walked out that store and I looked at my friend, I said, man, she cute, huh? He was like, yeah. I said, <laughs> I'm going back to talk to her, man. I'm going back to talk to her. And guess what, guys? He came back the next day and said, remember me from yesterday? I'm like, oh, okay, hi. And then I, I did not recognize him at all. Well, see, the, the, the day before, I was all raggedy, paint everywhere, uh, no haircut, no shave, nothing. But the next day I came, y'all, I was shaved up, <laughs> brand new haircut. Yeah, he, he was trying to impress me um, at, at that all moment. Flied up or whatever you guys call it these days. So, nah, she didn't recognize me. Mm -mm. And uh, so after that day, I went in there another day and I asked her, I said, do you got a man? She going to tell me, yeah, I got many men. <laughs> <laughs> the reason I said that to him, because I don't want him to get impression that, you know, he can get me that easy. <laughs> That's why I told him that. <laughs> uh, so I ain't give up, y'all. After that, the next time I went in there, I was going through her line. Yeah, I started looking for her. I went through her line. I slipped her this note. And the note said, you don't need many men, just one good man. <laughs> <laughs> and left my number. But she never, never called. She didn't call. A couple of days later, I went in there again. I bought some. And I set a rose down on, on the counter for her. And then, you know, I walked off. She still didn't call me. I'm like, man. He was very, very persistent. But, you know what he she... would get? Let me tell you what he bought. Every time he goes to the store, he would buy cleaning stuff. I'm thinking to myself, man, his house must be really, <laughs> really clean. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, she, well, I know now, y'all, because she told me, she thought I was a stalker. She told her friend that, this black man stalking me. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. He was stalking me that every time he goes there. Uh, but I didn't give up, y'all. So Christmas came around because she still hadn't called me. It was Christmas Eve. I went into the store. 
I bought this gift set. I bought a gift bag. I went into her line. She rung it up. After she rang it up, I put the gift set in the gift bag and I handed it to her. I said, this is for you. Merry Christmas. So she was smiling and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yes, she was. Oh, yeah. oh, my goodness. And then after that, she finally called me. She finally called me. I wasn't going to call him, but one of my friends said, just call him and thank him. I go, I, I already did, but he handed me the gift. <laughs> <laughs> and then when I called him, I forgot to block my number. And then a few hours later, he called me back. I'm like, oh, no. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. But look. We still together that 15, 15 years, years ago. Yeah. You know, we had our up and downs, but if you stick in it, relationships, they, they work, y'all. They work. Uh, we had our good times. We had our bad times. But now, you know, we still together. We happy. We on a mission. You know, we living in the Philippines now. We, we have the opportunity to um, help people, you know. And in the beginning, you know, it won't, it won't be big help it'd be whatever we can do you know um because you know it's just my retirement but here i i could i could still help people and, and do some things so you guys subscriptions uh, are important to us you know subscribing is free but when you subscribe eventually that's going to help us to be able to help more people right Right, so, so don't forget to hit the like, hit the like subscribe, button, subscribe, follow us. Follow. It'll be really, really fun. You guys will see all our videos. That's right. The more people subscribe, the more people we can help. So that's our love story. Yeah. And she's still smiling after all these years. That's right. <laughs> she's still smiling. Thank you guys for watching us. See Black men in the village. We're going to hit the village soon. We want you guys there. Follow us. Adventure. Thank you. Peace Thank out. You. <laughs>